Today we will be unlocking Plague Diamond on shotguns in one game. Now you might be thinking, how the hell am I going to do this? Well, I've made progress on every single shotgun. There's four. There's the combat shotgun, the iron horn shotgun, double barrel shotgun, and the Gracie shotgun. And over these past few days, well, ever since launch, I've been grinding to level these up to level 70. And in the meantime, I kind of made progress on them in zombies and realized, huh, I have quite a lot and I could just, you know, go into a game and unlock these one by one, back out and stuff like that. But instead I thought, hey, it would be pretty cool if I did a challenge where instead I hop in with one shotgun and then having to hit the box multiple times to get every single other weapon. So that's what we'll be trying to do today, trying to see if it's possible, trying to see if I'm successful at the end, if I do successfully unlock it or even if I don't succeed. I will still show off Plague Diamond and Gold Viper on these shotguns and see if it's worth unlocking. Yes, there is a glitch to do this and, you know, get them for free, but we out here unlocking these for real and tomorrow i will have a guide on how to do these challenges because there are some strategies that i did learn over my time playing a lot of zombies before we fully get into it as always be sure to subscribe we're on the road to hitting 50,000 subscribers maybe one of these days and also be sure to drop a like on the video if you did enjoy it in any kind of way comment down below what you would like for me to go next for plague diamond if it's pistols snipers ars anything like that hope you enjoy the rest of the video Okay, and so we have begun. I've spawned in with the combat shotgun because I still need to do my seven attachment kills. I only need like around 120, I think, so it's not a lot. And obviously other challenges. I've written everything down and probably the most difficult thing will be to get the other shotguns. But yeah, here goes nothing. I have started a timer. Well, just kind of know when I start and we'll be probably here for a while. Well, obviously it'll be really quick for you, but... I'm guessing I'll be here for a few hours. Probably the most annoying part of this will be to get all the weapons from the box and then trying to complete some of these challenges because, I'll be honest, I do have quite a few that are, are kind of annoying, so I'm not really looking forward to that. But on the other side, I guess I could just complete the combat shotgun, if anything. I really don't want to fail this. I really want to do it all in one game. And one bad thing I will say about this is the fact that shotguns are ridiculously overpowered. And uh, I don't know if you've seen, but a lot of people have been making videos. A lot of people have been just using them in multiplayer. And they're not very well received throughout the community. Zom well, zombies, I think, you know, people don't care because it's zombies. But multiplayer-wise. So when I was trying to level these up, oh my god, the amount of hate I, I got from, like, people in the game. They were just, like, giving out to me because I was using the shotguns and I wasn't using them because they're good. Honestly, I started this exactly like a week ago when the game released. It took me quite some time to level these up. Okay, I need to get rapid kills as well. So let's see if I can get it here. Uh, crit, crit, crit. Oh, <laughs> and we did. So that's progression. We have 21 and I think there's 30 that we need to get. So that's pretty cool. Oh my God, yes. No, which one? Okay, I'm gonna go for Unholy Ground. We're gonna use Unholy Ground mainly for our Covenant kills. But this is huge! I need to get- Oh my god, this is- Okay, okay, okay. Now, <laughs> now all we need is the actual shotguns, but I won't worry about that just yet. I actually don't know which round I want to go up to and just do most of these challenges for the combat shotgun. I want to do it as early as possible so I can have a chance to use other shotguns if they have, like, terrible attachments. But, um, yeah, I think maybe, like, round- Whenever I have a pack a bunch, so next round I think I could go into harvest mode and just go through the painful process of trying to, you know, do uh, the camo challenges. There, it would be kind of cool if I could get a different shotgun to make progress on it as well. Oh, hey, we completed one full camo set. That was actually really easy. I don't know why I had no progress there. So we can cross off critical kills rapidly, thirty times off of the list. I think we have like three more camo challenge groups to do, and then. And then we've we've completed the combat shotgun. One other thing I'm really worried about doing these challenges is I can't pause the game. So if I have to go do something, you know, out of nowhere, <laughs> I might lose this all. So, you know, there's a bit of a bit more difficulty added on to with the whole, you know, I could just end up losing everything because of a stupid pause feature not being added. Man, I can't <gasps> Two dozen eliminations, we completed that challenge, let's go! We have two left, covenant ones and rapid kills, which we can't really do the rapid, 10 rapid kills, which is the carnage medal. That one should be kind of easier to complete in the higher rounds, so I think round eight, I know I said a different round earlier, but round eight should be good enough to complete that. Oh, never mind, we just got a carnage medal. That was actually not too bad, so we can do it. Oh, did we just make progress on a camel? Let's go! All right, okay, this is this is going pretty well, but I don't want to be too excited because obviously you could all end with a stupid box luck not being in our favor. How did oh, oh my god, we just got another one? Okay, okay, rapid kills are, are, are starting to get easier. Oh, 
oh, we just made more progress. Let's go. I think that was the Covenant kills. Oh, my God. We are we are actually so close to doing this. Let's go. Big dub. Oh, my God. I am. I'm looking forward to this. <laughs> what? No. I already have the combat shotgun of all the shotguns you could have given me. God. Oh, my God. Oh, oh. Oh, oh, that's a shotgun we don't have. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Oh, my God. <laughs> I just spent like 8,000 points. Oh, my God. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, that could have been a good idea or a bad idea. Okay, okay. We have it on the side. I don't think it has any attachments. So, that might be an issue. But still, who cares? Oh, my God. Okay, I want to test out. How does it behave in round five? Oh, close up. One shot. Close up. It's not pack a punch. So... It wouldn't be anything amazing. But still, we have it. I actually don't know what challenges we have for it. Uh, we have Pack-a-Punch kills and Covenant kills with it. So, at least we don't need to get any headshots, rapid kills, or anything like that. So, it's not too bad. Whoa, 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 no! Oh, frick. That's not good. That is so not good. I goofed, I goofed, I goofed, I goofed. But that's okay. We still got this. I'm definitely not way more stressed because I have two shotguns and I could make at least two shotgun progress on this. And, you know, I could fail this very easily right now. I'm not stressed at all. You're stressed. What do you mean? Oh, 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 let's go. Okay, okay. All we have left is covenants. Oh, my God. Yes. All we need to do is just get a few more covenant kills. And then we have the combat shotgun, Golden Viper. This is huge. Let's go. And then we can make progress. Oh, let's go. We just got gold. Golden Viper. <laughs> let's go. That was, okay, the combat shotgun, very easy. Very, very easy to complete. That's one done. Three more to go. Oh, my God. Okay, I can make progress now. Let's hope we don't die. Okay, okay. Next up is the Gracie shotgun. Not the one I exactly wanted to do now. Uh, we don't have a pack a bunch, so it would be a bit annoying. But, yeah, combat shotgun down. Let's go. So for this shotgun, we need to get <laughs> 800 pack a punch kills and like 400, I think, of Covenant kills. So yeah, it's it's pretty bad. It's not great, um, but, but we could do it, I think, <laughs> right? You know, I should have probably made a bit more progress on this shotgun, if anything. But here we are, you know, playing this game probably for like six hours. Uh, oh, we just made progress. Where was it? 3,200. So now we need... Now we need 800. Okay, now, from now on, that was the 800 kill. Oh my god, we just got another Gracie shotgun? What? <laughs> I Give me something else, man. What the hell? I mean, it's great rarity, just like the one we got. Um, I don't think they drop with attachments, which is probably one of the worst parts. This challenge would definitely be way more easier if I had more people in my game, you know, since they could probably drop me the shotguns and stuff like that. But I think that's even more kind of challenging. Uh, I want to first test it out. Test it out if if I have the mental capacity to do it solo. If I don't, and if I decide to do this challenge again on any other weapon, we might do it with more players. But for now, we're playing it solo, and that might be a terrible idea. Because, man, 800 kills is actually a lot. Man, I should have made progress on this. Oh? As a result of Covenant. Okay, so we need 200 more and we have the Covenant challenge done. And then, obviously, the last one will be just the Pack-a-Punch kills. Which is probably the most annoying. Oh my god, okay, this is kind of good. I'm trying to just figure out the best strategies for, like, going for these camos. And this is probably one of the most brain-dead ones. They're all walking through this one doorway. What if I come up closer? <laughs> They're all just walking through this one area so I could just keep spamming. Okay, that's pretty good. So this is going to be me for the next probably hour-ish to get all these kills done. If it takes way too long, I might just go and progress in the rounds. But I want to do this as early as possible. So I have time to, you know, progress the rounds and get pack-a-punch stuff and for other shotguns. But hopefully we get the Gracie shotgun done. Oh, oh. 2,000. We did the Covenant kills. Let's go. Okay, now all we need to do is just, you know, around 800, 700 maybe something. I don't even know. You know, a lot of kills. A lot of kills. Alright, by the way, I had to move because I kind of messed it up. But this is pretty good as well. Oh, 3,600? Okay, that's... Whoa. Am I... Am I getting way more kills than I thought I'd be getting? Okay, we only need 400 more kills? 
Okay, maybe I was overestimating how much 800 kills is at these rounds. That's not too bad. Damn, okay. I'm, I'm getting more and more excited. But then again, the more thought that I give to it, I'm like, how difficult will it be to get the other shotguns? Because we might have gotten two, which is huge, you know, to get two shotguns done in one game. I think that's pretty good. But for the first time ever trying this, I want to, I really want to complete it one game, you know? I, I really want to complete it. Oh, okay, I leveled up. Oh, we did it. Let's go. Two play uh, plague diamond golden viper camos let's go okay that's two out of four in one game and <laughs> this is so cool this is actually kind of it's kind of you know exciting to do all of this but yeah that's the gracie shotgun and combat shotgun now done all we have to worry about now is to you know get the double barrel and the iron horn from the box but yeah we have like twenty nine thousand points to do that so it's it shouldn't be that bad that actually didn't take me as long as I thought it would. It took me like 18 minutes. Let's see what we got. Oh, baby, let's go. We just upgraded the best thing. Uh, let's hit the box a few times, see if we can get it. And if we don't, then just... <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. This I thought this was going to be actually, you know, annoying to get. Oh, my God. And then the double barrel will be last. It's kind of bad that the double barrel will be last. But you know what? You gotta do what you gotta do. Um, all I have to do with this is get... Actually, I don't know. I think I need to get, like, Covenant kills. Yeah, I need to get quite a few Rapid kills and a few Covenant kills. Yeah, the next one is Blitz. So, I'm gonna try to get some Rapid kills in Blitz. And if anything, then we can come out, try to get a double barrel. And hopefully, then on round, like, 8, complete our last last camo challenges on both the double barrel and the Einhorn. I have, like, 7,000 points. I could try... To go and hit the box a few times. <sighs> mm, let's let's see. Let's see what we get. Or you know what else I could do? Is actually go around and kill big dudes. And open the chests. And the crystals. Hopefully maybe some of them will drop what we need. Oh we also need to go get a self res. I need to remember. Buy self res. Okay so I wasn't able to get the double barrel. I searched the whole map. Killed all the big dudes. Hit the box a few times. Ran out of points. But here we are. I don't know if we'll be able to get the double barrel next round. We'll see. We'll spend a lot of points on the box. Um, yeah, but at least that's that's going to be basically three. Uh, hopefully we don't die. Three shotguns out of four. Great progress. No, man. I just keep getting shotguns that I don't need. Come on. I got the Gracie shotgun like three times. We got the combat shotgun like three times. Man, wh wh where's the double barrel at? Is that a bayonet? Wait, what? You can have the bayonet attachment in zombies? What? What? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Yo, look at this. I did not know you can have this in zombies. Hey, they didn't remove everything fun from zombies. Okay, I guess we're just going to be doing the camo challenges for the Einhorn this time around. Uh, I think I think the double barrel might be, might be way more challenging than I thought to get, which is a bit upsetting. Okay, so one thing I'm noticing is rapid kills with meleeing is way faster and just have the bullets as like a backup to get them long distance. I've been doing this challenge all wrong. So just get the covenant. Uh, what is it called again? Ooh, something. <laughs> Bloodlust. That's the one. It's called Bloodlust. And if you just melee them fast, let's see. Uh, there we go. There we go. And just shoot these. There we go. Carnage metal. Okay, yeah. This is way easier than, than I've been doing these camo challenges. Hey, we did the rapid kills. Okay, now I think we only need a few more covenant kills. And that is our third shotgun complete. This is insane. Was that it? Hey, we just got our third golden viper. <laughs> Let's go. Oh my god. All that's left is that stupid double barrel. Third gold viper in the game. Let's go. Big dub. Big dub. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is obviously progress, get our points, and then spend probably a very long time trying to get the double barrel. And if it doesn't work out, I guess I have to go and collect more points and so on and so forth. But I'm not giving up. We are too far into it. There's no going back now. <laughs> I hit the box like four times oh my god oh my god this is it guys this is it 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 
This is it. We're doing it. We're getting Plague Diamond in one game. Holy frick. This is this is epic. This is absolutely epic. I can't actually believe that. <laughs> now, it doesn't seem to have attachments, which sucks, because I was hoping for maybe, you know, like a red dot side or something, because I need to get some, some uh, critical kills rapidly, but yeah. At least we have it. You know, that's all that matters. We have the double barrel. Fourth and last shotgun to get Golden Viper on to then get our sexy Plague Demon. Or is it Plague? I hear some people say that it's Plague Diamond, Plague Diamond. Personally, I think it's Plague. 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 Also, we finally got the Covenant that gives me my ammo back whenever I get critical kills, which is pretty big with this shotgun especially. So that's perfect timing. We have a gold rarity, you know? It says there's a crystal here, but there isn't. There's like blood splatter on the ground if that counts. So we need to get pack a punch kills, rapid kills, and covenant kills with this. So this will probably, you know, it'll probably take quite some time. But, you know, it's the last one, and I am devoted to completing this challenge. Oh, we just got a camo. 100 boom i didn't even know i needed those <laughs> well then i guess we needed those as well hopefully i wrote out every single camo and i wasn't wrong because this would be pretty awkward if let's say i still needed my seven attachments oh my god <laughs> okay we got a pretty poo poo transmit but if i can get it in that angle i did last time maybe we'll be able to complete this with ease turns out i don't need critical rapid kills i just need rapid kills and i need like 25 so maybe this won't be the mode to do it because we're just gonna have to wait and find out oh oh we just completed the covenant camera okay we're, we're getting closer and closer it's just i'm a bit worried about the uh, rapid kills to be honest but we're at the stage where i kind of want to do my strategy and this is where we're gonna stay, I guess. I like how in this video, we've literally not visited Shino Numa once. I haven't been Shino once. It's the rotations of these maps that's so weird. I've gotten the same one over and over, but no Shino Numa. I mean, to be honest, it's good. Shino Numa, I, I'm not a fan of it. Did we even get Hotel Royale? I don't think we did. We've been literally rotating from Red Star to the Windmill map, which I don't know the name of. Oh, 3,600 Pack-a-Punch kills. Only 400 more and we have that done. That's pretty epic. I think we are actually pretty close. We're not We're not doing too bad. I, I seriously underestimated everything to do with this challenge. It's taking me about two hours now, which is quite a long time. But I don't mind. I was like prepared for four hours. See, we're getting Carnage medals. We're doing good, gamers. We got this. I don't want to jinx it, but we got this. This reminds me a lot of the Colonel's Office from Firebase Z. Because all you have to do... Oh, we just got a camo progression. All you have to do is just sit in one area and just, just keep firing. If it gets a bit too tight or let's say anything like that, just back up. Or let's say you run out of ammo. Just let the zombies get up closer to you and just pick up the ammo. Just don't get close to the orb. This is definitely one of the best. Because they spawn jumping from there and from the side. And you can like... We can get the rapid kills very easily here. Oh my god. 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 Did we do it? Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh my god. We did it. We did it. Oh my god. Show it to me. Show it to me. Show me the camo. Yeah. Plague diamond, baby. We did it. We did it, baby. Oh my god. We actually did it. Holy frick, we just unlocked Plague Diamond. <laughs> we did that. That was like two-ish hours. Oh my god. Okay, I guess now let's hop into a game where I'm going to show you the Gold Viper and the Plague Diamond on all the shotguns. And yeah, we did it, boys. We did it. Big dub. If you haven't dropped a like yet, I think that deserves a like because I was not expecting to complete that. Okay, and here we have Golden Viper. I tested out a few maps to see which... You know, camos look the best on. And I have to say, this map really does it justice. And look at the view. Hell yeah. But yeah, no, this is Golden Viper. It definitely really stands out in this map. Like, you can see all the detail and everything. I'm a big fan. I really like the color scheme. I I don't know. I thought I wasn't going to be a huge fan of it. But but I really do enjoy it. Here is the combat shotgun. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. There's definitely less of the Golden Viper or the actual 
like you know metallic bit on it so I, I don't know if i'm a huge fan of that but yeah there there's the einhorn and a combat shotgun now here is the gracie shotgun similar to the combat there's just not enough of the like actual bronze camo on it so i don't know how to feel about it it's just a handle like everything else is just i don't know i'm not i'm not a fan of it definitely and oh my god here is the double barrel with the akimbo attachment i had to do it akimbo was just so cool on weapons and yeah this is definitely the best one it has probably the most of the actual golden viper on it and i really love the golden viper Ooh, i feel like gold multiplayer would look amazing on this as well this is this is pretty good and now for the diamond i'll be honest diamond looks pretty bad on every single map apart from this one in my opinion it just kind of stands out more definitely not a fan of it i feel like they could definitely like brighten up the pinkish purple bits of the weapon and either made the gray bits which is supposed to be i guess the diamond bits a bit more brighter to make it more pearly or just change it pink as well similar to the cold war one just just because this doesn't look all that great and here's the combat shotgun definitely similar to the actual golden viper more of this pinkish color if it stood out more i think this would have looked way better but yeah i don't know it looks okay it just it doesn't look anything like a special camo that i worked my ass off for and here's the gracie shotgun similar to the golden viper actually no i, I think i do prefer this one definitely more just make the pink stand out more and i love this camo i don't know it's just it's, it's such a dull looking camo to be honest for you know one of the mastery ones and lastly here are the bad boys yeah no golden viper definitely looked better on them uh definitely way more of these stud looking diamond bits on it just make it stand out more it's gray why is it gray it's so weird Ooh, this looks good look at that this looks actually pretty good i do like that is the blue background but yeah, that's going to be for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to subscribe. Uh, I'm going to have a guide up on this tomorrow. So whenever this video goes up. Oh, look, there's like a thing that somebody climbed, climbed up on. Uh, so if you are looking forward to, you know, any kind of guide on how to unlock these really fast in zombies. Because there are some strategies. I, I will have that link down in the description if this video, you know, you watch it later. This did take me quite some time to get up here. And if you do enjoy this kind of a series, I might as well do it with every single weapon in the game. So, you know, like pistols, snipers and stuff like that. And also comment down below what you would like me to do next. Because I have no idea. Sorry for the length of this video if it is super long. You know, it took a quite some time. Like two and a half hours to record everything fully. You know, to find the maps and stuff. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for subscribing. 50k, here we come. Thank you so much for liking. And I will see you all guys in the next one. Peace out. Classic Philly Z smooch. You know what? I haven't done that in a while. Peace out.